<laughs> Yo, what up, what up? It's Big Brandon Carter, BBC. A uh, question I get a lot is, uh, yo, Big Brandon Carter, BBC, um, I'm trying to I'm trying to put on some weight, I'm bulking up, I'm bulking up right now, I'm trying to put on a little bit of weight, I'm trying to put on a little bit of that muscle mass, muscle mass, so should I do cardio while I'm trying to put on muscle mass? I would, a lot of people say, yo, skip the cardio when you're bulking up, you know what I'm saying, because you're going to burn calories, you need those excess calories uh, to, to, for your body to build muscle, a lot of people say they do no cardio when they're bulking up. But uh, I say, fuck that. Do cardio while you're bulking up. I think you should do about, I think about two to three times a week, you should do 10 to 15 minutes of hit cardio. All right, nothing crazy, no crazy amount, just like 10 to 15 minutes, two to three times a week. You should either do it uh, after your weight training or on uh, a day when you don't, uh, when, you're, when you're not doing any resistance training. Uh, you never do real cardio before resistance training ever. Uh, you can warm up a little bit before, you know, you can, you know, do the motherfucking, what's that shit called, the elliptical, <laughs> or, you know, saying some jumping jerks or something before you work out, before you do your real resistance training, but you never want to do anything intense before resistance training. I have a video on it because, you know, you want to, you want to save your, most of your energy uh, for putting on muscle mass. Here are a few reasons why you should do cardio while you're bulking up. One, uh, you want to keep your conditioning high, man, like you want to keep your heart in good condition, your cardiovascular system. Well, once, uh, when I was younger, I, I, I bulked up and I uh, put on like a lot of weight uh, without doing cardio. And I, uh, I bulked while I was younger and I, I put on some extra pounds, but I actually felt it. Like my heart, I could feel, I felt my heart working harder. Like when I walked upstairs or like I was living in DC, I was in college in DC, Howard University, what up? I was in college in DC and there's a lot of hills in DC and I would walk up the fucking hills and I'm like, God damn, man. Like I felt it in my heart walking to class. My heart had yet to acclimate itself to the extra pounds that I had put on. From then on, I said, you know what? When, I, when, I'm, when I'm bulking up, I'm gonna do car, I'm gonna do a little bit of cardio just to keep my heart in shape so that my heart can adjust to this new amount of weight that it's gonna have to carry around. So that's one reason, because you wanna keep your conditioning high. You wanna stay in tip top condition, man. At least I do, because um, when I'm cutting, I'm going to be doing a lot more cardio and it's going to be more difficult if, if I've let my conditioning just go to shit while I was bulking. Another great reason to keep doing cardio while you're bulking up is cardio actually increases recovery time to uh, all your other muscles. It increases your heart's ability to pump blood. So like when you're doing cardio, you're, you're getting blood, uh, your blood is circulating all throughout your system. You get that blood flow. That increased blood flow helps muscles recover. The homie Steve Lowe was talking about that in uh, his book, uh, Overcoming Gravity. He trains, uh, Gymnasts, you know, gymnasts work out like fucking six, seven, eight hours a day, every day. They're doing full body workouts every day. He trained uh, Olympians and shit. He has a, like a whole section about how he made his athletes do cardio, not necessarily to stay thin, but so to increase their recovery between workouts. So, you know, uh, this is a good read actually. So it's, uh, it's pretty fascinating if you ever want to get a chance. It'll cost, I'll put a link in the description where you can copy it, you know. So in conclusion, when you're bulking up, trying to put on some muscle mass, you want to make sure that you're getting cardio two to three times a week for about 10 to 15 minutes. I say just do, I say just do hit cardio. I don't like steady state cardio. I do hits, I'll run some sprints or I'll jump rope, you know, uh, 30 seconds as fast as I can, take a 30 second break, 30 second fast as I can, take a 30 second break, and just keep repeating that for 15 minutes. That's an easy cardio routine, something real simple, It'll, it, it won't, Put too much stress on your body, but it'll get the it'll get blood flowing and it'll keep your conditioning up. All right, hope that helped. Oh, wait, before I forget, we got the new muscle mass T-shirts. Oh shit, that shit is clean, son. Shit is clean. I'll put a link in the description where you can get it. We got the T-shirts and we got muscle mass tank tops, bruh. <laughs> Yo, this shit is clean. Hold up, hold up, man. I posted this shit on my Instagram and my Facebook. The other day, and a lot of y'all, y'all, a lot of y'all went and bought them, man. That's what's up. A lot of y'all bought the muscle mass uh, tank tops, t-shirts. We got long sleeve shirts too. We got shirts for men and shirts for the women. We got the baby tank tops for the women. You know what I'm saying? Listen, get you a tank top. They real cheap, man. We got them for cheap. Get you a tank top or a t-shirt or a long sleeve shirt or whatever. You know? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Shit's clean, man. This shit is clean, man. Shit is clean, man. Yeah, man, get yours today. I'll put a link in the description, all right? <laughs>